So looking at our own management styles and behaviors through the stories that we tell, a lion was caught in a hunter's net and no matter how hard he struggled, he could not get free. He was caught so tight that he was completely helpless. He could do nothing but lie there and wait for the hunter to come back and kill him. But just as the lion had given up all hope of escape, he saw a little mouse wander past. This was it, finally a chance to get free. And so the lion called out to the mouse and begged for help. The mouse, who was just a tiny little creature, looked at the huge lion lying there with a lot of misgivings. He wasn't sure that he wanted to set the lion free. I mean, he wasn't even the size of the lion's mouth. It would take less than one gulp for the lion to eat him up. And so the mouse refused to help, but the lion begged and pleaded and cried and promised that he would not hurt the little mouse till finally he managed to convince the little creature to help him. And so the mouse climbed up on top of the lion and began to cut through the ropes and the knots one by one by one till finally he got to the very last knot. If he cut through this knot, the lion would be free. But just as he got to this last knot, the mouse stopped. The lion was furious. He roared at the mouse. He said, you promised to help me. You promised you would set me free. And now you're trying to go back on your word. But the mouse said, no, I will not go back on my word. I will set you free just as I promised. But I am going to wait till I see the hunter coming back before I set you free. If I let you out now, it could be that you keep your promise and you won't hurt me. Or it could be that you suddenly change your mind and eat me up and there will be nothing that I can do about it. But if I wait till the hunter gets here and then set you, then set you free, your only thought will be to save yourself. And I know that I will definitely be safe too. Now, I know that each of you will take away a different learning from this story. So I would like to invite you to write to me and my associate Smita Tharoor to share your thoughts with us. We have dedicated a special blog just for this sharing. Smita and I will also be posting our ideas here every Sunday. The details for the blog are on the screen below, as well as in the literature attached. Or you could leave us a message on either YouTube or the Facebook page.